right so welcome back to another vlog this is rakshit here how are you doing ella rohe gidira and uh, the most important thing that uh, happened for me was uh, uh, this is a big story you need to watch everything to understand uh, what exactly i've done for my 6r so first uh, there was this guy called fahim uh, fahim uh, who is actually the guy from jordan he also has a, a dyno setup in ua he actually came here and uh, <laughs> recorded the highest uh, a uh, drag race record on a boza which means shaman he crossed shaman with a bus record which means on a stock boza that's what he has done uh, he's known across the industry uh, for very very good reasons because he's a great tuner and uh, with that uh, while i met him uh, i went to monkey autocrafts they actually started a dyno as well so dyno has been the setup but i wanted some tuner who exactly has a knowledge of tuning a motorcycle so what i did so you would have seen my rapid evo installation on my 6r as well so i installed that and then uh, while uh, uh, fahim referred to me to directly flash the to you uh, issue itself uh, we did uh, flash the rapid evo first which means that we try to tune as much as possible but i didn't see a significant difference because i already seen the peak of uh, rapid evo because i've already tuned it in that way because it was a full system stage one already done uh and then after a very very hard thing uh, i decided to do a stage 2 you will see two different videos in the uh, after i finish talking first you will see a tune on rapid evo wherein the horsepower was somewhere on the dyno was somewhere around 114 115 horsepower and the second half of it wherein the ecu stage 2 has been reflashed in that you won't believe it touched the whooping 124 125 hz horsepower right it's only not about the number but uh, when you do a, a stage 2 ecu reflash the rev limiter for stock 6r is somewhere around 14500 now it revs up to 17500 which means that uh, it can actually uh, go beyond close to 300 in fact so that's the thing and also the quick shifter has become very smooth up the fueling has been adjusted the fr has been adjusted right so there's so many stages that has happened and you will see my stage 2 reaction uh, vlog coming very soon for now if you go ahead and watch the video and this is the entire context so the tune charges somewhere uh, roughly in between 400 to 500 dollars in us so you can calculate based on your location or your base stop you can also send him uh, the issue as well i'll try to put his instagram uh, link in my description and uh, if i have given with a lot of thought it means that i would have made my research about this guy so for now i feel a fantastic difference but i haven't pushed it to the limit and uh, it is linear across the band now and i really can't wait to take it to the hasan road and ride it across so that's the background to it so with that i'll try to end the vlog here you will continue uh, to see uh, the second piece of it uh, after i finish speaking like i said uh, with that uh, take care and if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and if you need any leads that you want to know about 6r uh, please let me know and then i think my 6r on the not any modifications that has made i think is the fastest uh on a dyno at least if i cut down my weight maybe with the race fitting everything it will be much more faster but 125 horsepower on a ecu reflash plus 15 to 16% on road which means that the road will also add it somewhere on 140 maybe the rammer can add about one or two horsepower 143 144 is a significant number for a 600 cc and torque is about somewhere close to somewhere on 48 49 50 and that's about it and uh, until then that's the numbers see you peace bye